triggered a number of court cases which have raised significant legal questions. According to judges handling the cases, the Senate sided with the National Assembly on five out of 11 charges against the DP with his legal team preparing for one of a kind court battle. At the start of the impeachment process, Oste Deputy President Rigathi Gashago faced 11 counts, which, according to the move of the motion, Kibwezi West MP Mwengi Mutuse had the way to remove him from office by way of impeachment. And after turbulent afternoon on Thursday, the Senate voted to host the DP on five out of 11 grounds, finding no enough grounds on six grounds. Gashago's goose was cooked as soon as the first vote, which was supported by 53 senators, with just 13 siding with the self proclaimed truthful man. Gross violation of Articles 10 to A, B, and C 274, I had already read it up. The Senate found the DP guilty of operating outside his I office by publicly attacking and undermining the work of the National Intelligence Service, with 46 senators vote voting in support of it, while 30 senators voted against it. The Senate also accused the second in command of breaching his oath of office and allegiance. 49 senators upheld the charge against the DP, while 16 of them voted against this matter. Geoffrey Rigadi Gashago was also found guilty of undermining judicial independence through public attacks on a judge. 51 senators found him guilty, while 16 opposed. But according to Gashago's legal team, the decision was unwarranted. Until these matters are argued on the 24th, and the courts will give us direction, as they have said, what it is. Yeah. So our teams are ready for it. What seems to ike the legal team is the fact that Parliament rushed to host him, despite being within constitutional timelines. The legal team expected to mount a legal showdown from next week, seeking to overturn the decision to send Geshagwa packing. Paul Kirobi, TV47, Nairobi. Thank you, Paul Kirobi, and cost.